Hey, what's up? It's Emily. And before we get into this video, I wanted to take a minute to talk about my channel and its purpose. I've always been someone that gets itchy when I sit still for too long. <laughs> I've always been someone with big ideas, but I've also been someone that always lacked the follow through to make those ideas become reality. And so this channel is about challenging myself to change that. So just do it! Make your dreams come true! It starts right now with this project. I wouldn't call myself a great painter, but Painting is definitely something that I love to do, and one of my goals has been to take it up a notch and paint a mural. I never had the opportunity until recently. This is Joe. Just got to the trailhead of Grotto Falls. Look at this view. This is Joe's bus. checking out the bus and things did not go exactly according to plan. I definitely forgot that there is an emergency exit in the ceiling. This uh, spackling is not going to work. It's taking way too long. I'm going to have to find a different way to work with these uh, holes in the ceiling. Hopefully it'll just be okay to paint over them. It was pretty devastating. It keeps falling down in chunks and like landing here, but a big chunk fell and landed in my coffee, so I'm pretty upset about it. <laughs> Oh, okay. 
So here's the situation. The ceiling is done, the base coat, and it's blue, and it looks great. Now is the time for me to, to send it, to try to get the mural part actually going, and I'm nervous. I'm scared that I'm gonna mess up what looks good right now, and I'm starting to doubt my painting skills. I don't want to mess it up, but, uh, you know, Bob Ross tells us that we gotta be brave. <laughs> we, don't, we don't make mistakes. We have happy accidents. Uh, fingers crossed. Okay, it's time. It's a little bit cold in here today. It's about one degree outside. There's nowhere that I'd rather spend the first day of the year than painting all day in this glorious bus. So let's do this. <laughs> waiting for it to open a uh, thrift store because I need more um, magazines. The last two days I've been working in there have been at night so I haven't been filming but it's been going pretty good. Welcome back to the bus. I spent some time this morning organizing everything so that hopefully today work will go by faster and I don't have to look for things. There is definitely a learning curve to working on in such a small space, in such a weird space. I've hit my head right here, I've hit my head right here. It's a little bit slanted and sometimes you slip. It just it makes it all the more exciting. collage. I feel like collage is a really lost art. Um, 
gluing it all together it's just like I think it's a really creative process like trying to make it connect and sometimes it's it's hard to like destroy these beautiful magazines <laughs> and I bought a book today too to destroy National Geographic Ultimate Journey for Two. Oh. Maybe I should keep this. <laughs> I didn't really look at what it was. I just saw there's all these like really good ocean pictures. Like, all kinds of beautiful destinations. Like, I wanna do this. Okay, maybe maybe I won't destroy this one. The two National Geographics I got are the Everglades and Macaws. And right now I am searching for pictures of anything water related. Last day on the bus, it's January 6th, 6th, and um, I still have a lot to do today, but it's coming to a close and I can see the finish line. I have a last list of things I need to get done today. I'm starting today feeling... When I took on this project, I knew that it would not be easy. I felt a lot of emotions around the trust that Joe had put, in, put into me. <laughs> He believed that I would do a good job even when I didn't and I was really nervous that I was going to let him down. But either way, if he loves it or he hates it, it's uh, going to be over with after tomorrow so I better enjoy my last day.
today is the last day. It's finally here. It's finally happening. Joe's gonna see the bus and I'm so nervous to show it to him. Uh, all I have to do today is the sealant on top and cleaning up the edges and then... <laughs> This is so sick, Emily. I love the turquoise color too. Do you? Okay, yeah. good. That's so sick, Emily. Oh, this is so cool. Oh, this is so cool. Emily, thank you so much. 
<laughs> so cool. <laughs> you like it? Love it. So in the end, Joe ended up really liking the paint or else he's a really good liar because I believe that he does. Um, I'm so thankful that I got this opportunity and in the end, I'm really proud of the work that I put into this and the way that it all turned out. I enjoyed every step of the process and I hope that you enjoyed watching. Hopefully, I'll see you soon with the next project. Bye! Tim, what happened to you? I had a football. <laughs>